Jim Brown, one of the greatest running backs of all time. What was his influence on you in Cleveland? Well, uh, I had the pleasure of uh, playing two seasons uh, with Jim Brown in Cleveland. He was a legendary player when I joined the organization. My first year in 1960, I uh, followed his career because the Cleveland Browns were my favorite football, NFL football team. Uh, my hometown, and, uh, which was a small industrial town, formerly a small industrial town in Warren, Ohio, was just 50 miles away. So my favorite sports teams were uh, the Cleveland Browns football and the Cleveland Indians baseball. And uh, uh, this phenomenal player uh, arrived in Cleveland in the latter part of the 50s, and the Cleveland Browns were already a, a championship organization, and he just heightened their ability uh, as a consistent winning team in pro football. One of the players that I identified with being a great player that he was, and then I had the pleasure of playing with him for two years uh, with the uh, Cleveland Brown organization. I found it to be a very rewarding experience because uh, some of the things that we had talked about in terms of uh, intimacies with regard to football strategies and so forth, uh, I must confess that uh, I watched in his preparation and the things that he took into consideration. And so the marvelous football player uh, running back that uh, fans and, and those of the, of the sports world saw, uh, there was more to it than just physical ability. Uh, there was a very shrewd, uh, very intimate, uh, intellectual approach to everything that he did. So the combination of physical as well as mental uh, preparation was the, of the essence to him, and he did not slack off on the mental application of it one iota, even though uh, he could have accomplished and all of the things that he accomplished, obviously, just from a physical standpoint. He uh, was really in tune. He knew everything about all the players. And where I gained this appreciation was we were practicing one day uh, against the uh, defense, and the defense were, was implementing defenses of the opponent that we were to play against, which was the New York Giants. And there was a player who played middle linebacker who had Sam Huff's number and so we were enacting a running play let's say going from left to right and and Jim Brown gets the ball and he goes about two steps and then he stops and he makes a point that the player who was running Sam Huff's the player who was wearing Sam Huff's jersey in practice started out to his left and he said when I run this play Huff never goes to his left he always comes to his right. So I want you to line back up and we're going to run this play again and I want you to come to your right because that's what he's going to do in the ball game and I want to be able to rehearse that so that in the ball game it comes natural. So here's perhaps the greatest runner in pro football who's just not taking the hand off and say oh well I've got this great size, I've got this great speed so we'll, we'll just see what happens. No, he's got insight into what's going to happen before it happens. 